Hey YouTube watchers and seekers. Out here driving. A verse came to my mind. I'd like you all to go read it. It's really cool. So, you know how we discovered, other people discovered, I saw it. Now I can't unsee it. It is basically the way it was put to me. You can't unsee it once you see it. There is a group of people that are the Luke group. And there's another group of people, the Tribulation Saint, which belongs to the Mark. And I think Matthew group belongs to those that go into the Millennium. There, every Now when I read in the Bible different stories, and I'm like, it didn't make sense. I mean, it, it really didn't make sense. Have any of you ever read Luke 10, 38? Um, this is a story, Jesus is going along, and a woman named Martha comes out and collects him, brings him into the house. And Jesus is always preaching, always teaching, and he's talking, and Martha's sister is sitting there at his feet listening. She's completely engulfed with what he's saying. I could only imagine. Can you imagine? I mean, you remember when you was a kid? When I was a kid, um, the teacher would sit up when I was like in kindergarten. I still remember it. Uh, we had our pad we had to lay down on and she would read a story and then tell us to go to sleep and we'd all take a nap. Because if you don't take a nap, they knew sleep, you know, you weren't as ornery, I guess. So, but she would sit up there and read a story and we were all sitting at her feet. Not like on her feet, but you know, we were out in front of her at her feet. The same thing, can you imagine Jesus, the greatest storyteller of all time, is telling a story and Martha's sisters just sitting there, just, her name's Mary. Um, it's like my name is Mike. There are so many Mikes in the 50s and 60s, like everyone was named Mike. Um, and uh, back then it was no different. Um, a lot of people were named Mary. And... Uh, the cool thing is, is she sits there at his feet and what happens? Martha becomes upset, like she's mad. Martha's like, I'm over here working my butt off and I'm getting all this stuff ready. I don't think she said that to Jesus, but I'm working my tail off and getting all this stuff ready and I'm cooking and everything. I'm in a parking lot. Somebody decided like there's no cars out here and this person just decides to park right next to me. Like there's a million other spaces. Maybe they want to see me make a video. <laughs> Let me move. So she's infuriated. She's like angry. How come I'm doing all the work and she's just sitting there? And Jesus says she found what she's looking for. So what does that mean? What does that mean? You know? Martha's working. Martha's got work to do. Um, now they're both saved. Jesus came into their house. Both Martha and Mary are saved. But Mary was done. She was at his feet. She was listening to everything he had to say. She found what she was looking for. There was no work for her to do. The same thing, we are in the, the, the dispensation right now of grace. There's no work. Jesus did it all. He said it on the cross. It's finished. He did all the work. Um, what you do after that is proof evidence for court um but martha she's she's going through the tribulation she's in there sweating trying to get it all ready putting it all together uh the same thing is going to happen it's a different dispensation uh the tribulation saints now martha's still saved um she's not like a curse or anything but he knew or not it wasn't an intimate relationship mary was sitting at his feet martha was still working so I want to point that out to you, the difference. There's a lot of people, I mean, are beginning to see this, this gospel of grace that we're in right now and understanding there will be a difference, a big difference, when uh, grace is done and we go into the dispensation of the tribulation saint. Um, but remember, the Bible says there's going to be a great multitude, which no man can count, huge 
of those that go into the uh, after the tribulation they go into paradise it's gonna be an enormous group of people um, when uh, the, the ten virgins uh, five he said depart from me I knew you not it wasn't uh, I don't know you when you're going to hell it was I'm not intimate with you it's a no it's a new and uh, the other five just they went through tribulation they didn't have oil but they were still saved they were still ten virgins no matter how you look at it no matter how you slice it <laughs> the old ten are going to heaven just five of them went before the wrath and the other five will go after the wrath or yeah, after the wrath is over. During the wrath, after wrath. I'm not sure um, at what point in the seven years they'll go. There's good debate over that. Um, so I guess we'll find out. Remember, it's just a quick video to point that verse out because I thought about it today and I was like, I need to talk about that. So I know I never make two videos in one day, but we're getting close. It's almost time. I look up nonstop. I'm just dreaming of this day, you know. I I, I just really, I, I relate completely with Mary. I, I, there's really nothing I want to do. There's really, you know, nothing I need to get done. I'm just, I'm done. I'm ready to go, you know. Everything I have, I leave behind. Vehicles, houses, cars, business, it's all gone. I don't care. I don't want any of it. I want to be out of here, you know. So... But I can tell you this, that Mary and Martha went to a quiet place by themselves and they prayed. And they asked the Lord into their, into their house. If you read it very carefully, they were both saved. They both asked the Lord into their house. That's you. That's, that's what you do to, get, uh, to become saved. And then you watch, Revelation 3.3. 3. If you don't watch, I will come upon you in an hour when you don't expect. So you must watch. Watch. Every good watcher knows that. So keep watching and uh, come on into the Discord. I have a lot of great people in there um, discussing back and forth. And uh, so far it's very congenial. People are being pretty nice to each other. Some people get a little upset over things. But again, it's not a salvation issue in the Discord. We're discussing dates and times and and current events world events stuff that's going on you know but uh and we have a, a new room now where you can go in and give your testimony and uh, at the bottom you can go in and say what part of the planet you're from there's an interactive map you can actually see there's people from around the world in there it's crazy i didn't i didn't know that we were touching like the other side of the planet literally when i go to sleep other people are waking up and they're chatting in there all night long i wake up to 100 messages 50 messages and i'm like wow this is this is bigger than i ever thought it was it's bigger than me this is this is all god this is all belongs to him not me so uh come on in there and let's let's learn some stuff from each other you know so repo man 64 like comment share and subscribe and uh man i don't know how many more videos i'm gonna make to be honest with you i don't know how many more there are i mean the, the dates are coming like day after day now it was the 17th 18th 19th tomorrow is the 20th i'm seeing the 24th i mean there's just so much going on right now uh, jay justified is seeing the 11th and uh of august and uh, just so many wonderful people that are uh, just working on this and trying to figure it out. It has to be 2021. I don't think there's anybody that disagrees. It has to be 2021. The, everything lines up with this year, you know. So keep watching. Keep waiting. Stay uh, stay excited. It's, it's going to happen soon, very soon. It could happen right now before I hit the done button. Can you imagine? Bam. Of course this video wouldn't be posted then so anyway repo man 64 are you a martha or are you a mary you decide talk to you later youtube watchers and seekers